around the clock at Bikini Bottom. A demented, horrific, cringe SpongeBob horror game that became an absolute fan favorite of the Krusty Gamers Alliance. Okay, for the uninitiated, motherfucker, that's you! Was one of the most hated games that I have ever had the displeasure of playing on this channel because y'all wanted to see it episode after episode, time after time, y'all love watching my blood pressure rise. Well, let me go ahead and be the first to say that I think I found a SpongeBob horror game more motherfucking cringe than Around the Clock at Bikini Bottom. Ladies and gentlemen, let me present to you Motherfucking SpongeBob's evil clone! That was not how the intro was supposed to go. Let me run it back. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I'm mad, bitch. I don't wanna play this shit! I don't know why, I don't know anything about this game other than the fact that it's a new SpongeBob horror game, but what I do know is that that little demented ass, crusty ass SpongeBob model is the most ugly, cringe thing I've ever seen, and I'm already pissed. Okay, so don't type to me about Around the Clock at Bikini Bottom. That game is dead! And after this episode, so will this shit. Dom, stop talking and run the intro, let's write that back! Yes! Motherfucker! Yeah! In the vast expanse of existence, we often find ourselves entangled in a web of our own desires, driven by a hunger that knows no bounds. Oh, God, what is this storyline about to be? But you know the other thing about Around the Clock of Bikini Bottom that I was thinking about the other day? But we played that game for like 20 episodes. Okay, that is no exaggeration. And I shit you not, I don't know a motherfucking thing about the Around the Clock of Bikini Bottom storyline. I'm pretty sure it was just mumbled bullshit. This, this is looking the exact same. I don't even know what that means. What is this guy talking about? Who the hell is Teller? My computer's frozen. No, it's not. What's happening? Hello. Imagine a world where a tiny creature by the name of Plankton, consumed by an insatiable appetite for power, hatched a plan that would forever alter the course of destiny. With a mix of mischief and misguided ambition, Plankton sought to create a malevolent replica of our beloved SpongeBob SquarePants, embodying the very essence of our darkest desires. Oh, mischief, misguided ambition, malevolent, DARKNESS! These motherfuckers use some big ass words! Bro, stop doing that shit! You ain't smart as hell because you can put that shit in chat GPT! Dumb that ass down! Okay, we know you don't even know what those words mean. Mo! As this nefarious doppelganger emerged from the depths, it brought with it a chilling reminder of the consequences that befall us when we succumb to our own greed. Nefarious- DO I NEED TO SAY IT AGAIN?! But fear not, for amidst the shadows of despair, a glimmer of hope shines through. It is in these moments of remorse that we come to understand the fragility of our own souls. You, my dear friend, now bear the weight of the world upon your shoulders. It is you who must embark on this perilous journey and confront the malevolence that threatens to consume us all. Bo, that cutscene made me lose 52 IQ points! Okay, I don't know, that, that, that voice acting actually wasn't bad, which leads me to believe that it was either AI, or there's no way it was a paid actor. Okay, I refuse to believe that! Look at the fucking graphics! I refuse to believe the fact that that was a paid actor, bro. There's no way. There's no way they had the budget for that. There's no way they had the budget! What is going on, Bo? What is Plankton Big Head at doing? Where are we at? What is this place? What the fuck? Bitch got like the Death Star. This bitch thinks he is Star Wars. What is going on, bro? Okay, so we're flying around the room. Why Why was narrator McGee not talking to me over this cutscene? Okay, that's what I'm wondering. Like, we could have really overlaid this little cutscene on top of Mr. Talks a lot, and it would have been way better. Then what the fuck is that, bro? Oh, is that the demonic SpongeBob clone? Oh, mama, look at that bitch! Oh, this game gonna be demented. I don't even think that this is necessarily a rage SpongeBob game. I think it just straight up might be a horror SpongeBob game. Oh my god, wait a minute. 
You see, I've seen that Patrick model before. I've seen that Patrick model before. Look at it. I don't know, but there's just something about his dumb bitchisms. Is that a word? Dumb bitchisms? Oh, you know what I mean. Okay, there's just something about the character model and the fact that it looks absolutely horrendous that I remember from the past. But I just, I remember it. And this Squidward model, it, this, it, have we played a game by this guy before? It seems like we might have. Good evening. Okay, so I said Bad that. Evening. Bad evening. What? Just say what do you want. Just say what do you want. Uh, one Krabby Patty. Have a seat. Thank you. Are you. Not you are not welcome. Okay, honestly, both that level of hateful customer service is more work than just than just being a good customer service representative. Cause he had to add the word I not. Oh God! God! No way, I just got scared by a cardboard cutout. Actually, fuck yourself, bro. Okay, let me sit down. Okay, so Squidward and Demented Patrick are at some point or another gonna serve me my food. Hey, yo, my burger's up, bro. My man, my burger's up, bro. My man, my burger's up. Good evening, sir. Ah, uh, hi, hi, hi. Hey, Sponge, good evening. Do you want hot sauce in your patty? I I'm good. Yes, please make it extra. I lied. Put me extra shit! Okay, sir, just a minute. Great, ah! thanks, Bunch. What the fuck was that? Okay, somebody just died! Bo, somebody is on fire! That scream that we just heard is absolutely... I am dying actively! That's what that scream is, Bo. What was that? Well... That was scary. Oh, SpongeBob was scared too, Bo. I will go to check. Can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor, said SpongeBob? There sure. There's a note in the kitchen with Cass. Do it and I will give you the patty for free. I have to check the boys. What? Okay, no problem. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait, I'm a paying customer. I just heard, I'm not kidding, but what sounded like somebody on fire in a goddamn fire tornado getting burned alive and SpongeBob. It's gonna go check it out, which is good. Okay, you would expect, you know, if you heard that kind of scream for somebody to go check it out, make sure everybody's okay. But what doesn't make sense to me is how in the flying fuck that whole sequence of events ended with me being an employee of the Krusty Krab. Bitch, how the fuck am I about to go back in here? And I'm glad I'm gonna do it, Bo. And work for the Krusty Krab. Throw the trash in the trash can. Put Mr. Krab's money in the box. Now, I will go ahead and point out that right now in the background, I am hearing some very, very close to actual real Spongebob music, and I think that shit might be copyrighted. So if this video is playing some different kind of music in the background that seems totally random, it's probably because that shit was copyrighted and Flatteen had to do some Houdini shit to make it okay. All right, now, what am I doing? Throw trash in the trash can. I'm really confused what's going on here. Where can I find some trash? Oh, it's this. Okay, okay, so it's not in the back room. It's in the, um. okay, uh, can I let it go or? There we go, oh, you son of a bitch. Okay, there we go. One piece. We grab this. Okay, so yeah, no deadass. I really am just an employee of the Krusty Krab. While, by the way, the actual employee of the Krusty Krab, big eyes, big nose, dumb bitch, my gee, big old head with no goddamn brain, micro brain, smooth brain, fuck your ass, Squidward, you bitch brain. Why am I going off right now? Anyway, because I'm doing the work at Squidward's not. That's why. Okay, ah. Unlike normal scenarios when I go off on random video game characters, this one is actually genuine! And it makes sense, motherfucker. Okay, it makes sense. A lot of the time I go off just because I'm a psychotic bitch! But this is not one of them. I'm going off because I'm doing this bitch's job. Look at him sitting there getting paid. That's crazy to do nothing. He's getting paid to do nothing. Goddamn cringe ass. Bop! So let me come in here and do the money shit then. All right. This one's nice and easy, because at least it's in the same room. Okay. I'm honestly not certain if this is copyrighted music or not. I've definitely heard the song that played before. Um, but these, like, low-budget knockoff Spongebob games almost always are, like, filled with a plethora of copyrighted poops and that we have to do a million things to on the back end. Uh, and I would just expect this one to be no different. Okay, so I put all the money away. I'm not getting any kind of, like, pop-up noise or nothing that tells me I did good. Oh! But there we go. Okay, I'm sitting down. I should be getting that burger for free, Bo. So where's Sponge at? Patrick Demonic ass no longer outside. Uh. Uh. What the fuck is that? Oh my God! It's Plankton's demon, SpongeBob. I am real, son. Hey, 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 hey! Back it up, motherfucker! Back it up a little bit! Oh my. 
my God. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh my God! I've never seen something so hideous, demented, and crusty, except for maybe y'all in the comment section. It was too easy, bro. It was too easy. You know how to take the chance. Hi, I am real SpongeBob, says Creepy Sponge. Uh, wait, how do I? Oh, there we go. I am not fake. Well, that's a little bizarre. I've never met somebody who's not fake say they're not fake. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying. Okay, so this is the most real SpongeBob in the world. Understood, well, understood, got it. You are real Patty. Okay, I gotta say, devs, listen to me, listen to me, listen to me. I mean this in the nicest way possible. If your voice lines are gonna be that dog shit on Ruski, just let me read the subtitles, Bo. Okay? The I just said quadradot, Bo. The real SpongeBob can dance, right? right? Yeah, that's correct. I I think so. Will too. I am real Spongebob. Bro, this guy doing too much. I literally never questioned, not once, the fact that this was the real SpongeBob and he's still going on about it. We about to see a demented dance, gang. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> later ladies and gentlemen what the fuck was that okay couple things number one my man said i'm gonna show you a little bit of a dance and then proceeded to give me a lap dance which first of all let me bamboozle beyond belief because that man has absolutely listen to me read my lips absolutely no motion in his hips okay the man has no dancing abilities not a leg i am perplexed bo Oh my god, and when Squibber ran off, okay, so I got a code on the wall, I can tell that already, um, when Squibber ran off, that was our chance to get the fuck out, bro, but instead I decided to dilly-dally around, sit around, and I got choke slammed by that goddamn ghoul, that's actually crazy, XXA, okay, what's my code, bro, what's my code, I can see it in two seconds, F-E-A-R, fear, the secret lies within the alphabet's order, bro, there's no way they think I'm so stupid that I can't figure out that! Obvious, obvious puzzle. I'm actually low-key offended. Oh, oh, no, you can hide. Bro, first of all, there's no... Oh, I see. Okay, so it's... But it's a number code. But it's a number code. So even though it's letters, it's a number code. So it's fear. The secret lies within the alphabet's order. Uh, okay. The alphabet's order. I don't understand what that means. Okay, actually, I fucking lied. This is a highly advanced mathematical equation and puzzle. Oh, uh, what? Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me figure this shit out. Bro, Saya, what the hell are they talking about? Okay, so this is a hell of a puzzle indeed. And you know what I got to say to the hell of a puzzle indeed, gods? Oh, fuck you. Wait. What? Wait a minute, gang. What? In what world would that make even a micro peepatito size bit of sense? Motherfucker, I'm sure I don't know. That code has to be absolutely 100% fabricated from Satan's booty hole. That makes no sense. Okay, as a high IQ gamer, I can tell you what. I can tell you when a puzzle makes no sense. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is a puzzle that makes no sense. Hello? What the fuck is this, bro? Sometimes you just need a flashlight to see things as they should be. I don't really understand what that means. Oh, good God! Oh, good God! Oh, that bitch runs like an actual dimension pool. Two hours later. Bro. Oh, so this is the worst game ever made. Let me just get to it, Bo. I don't really know what I'm supposed to do, but SpongeBob definitely came from that right side, so let me just move. Okay, shh, shh, What the hell is that, Bo? It's a red dot on top of a line with a green arrow on it. I don't recognize, I don't recognize that drawing. I'm gonna get cooked, but let me just... Where's the bomb? 
Wait, this place is... What the fuck? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay. I'm, I'm literally not stopping to look at basically anything because I'm just trying to see as much shit as I can see before I get tossed. Oh my god. Wait, there's a double dot with a red arrow. Wait, what the fuck? Okay, so I can't take any of this shit, but for some reason, SpongeBob has robots of all of these goddamn robotic ghouls. Shiny objects. Oh, are you supposed to drop some shit in here? I'm gonna run into SpongeBob any second now, okay? So don't even trip. Don't even be bamboozled, because right now what we're doing is just some Ricone sounds. Okay, and when I say that in this scenario, I actually mean real Ricone songs and not cheating Ricone songs. I just need to get a layout for this map, figure out what the fuck's popping. Oh my god, look at this hallway, bro. What the? They're unbelievable with this. Let me just keep going. I saw a doorway there. Four dots. Black arrow. Okay, what? Gang. But every time you see that shit, it don't tell you nothing. This is a yellow arrow. Okay, this shows you all the arrows. This shows you all the dots. Apparently, there's nine. What the fuck? Wait, this looks like an advanced gameplay, actually, after all! Wait, this might be more bullshit than the, the original Around the Clock. Oh. oh, I need to find a key and solve the code. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So that's what the colors correspond to the shit. Now, wait a minute. I need to take a picture of this. I need to take this before I get cooked. Okay, there we go. And this says yellow three, okay? I mean, I'm not gonna remember that, okay? It turns out there's way more than I than I anticipated. There's a lever that goes there. I need a lever and a key, okay? Those are the two items I'm looking for at present. A letter, or not a letter, a lever and a key. Look at that demented ass picture. You know that bitch thinks he looks good in that picture. That's why he hung it up. Crusty ass motherfucker don't know goddamn fashion when he sees it, or lack thereof. Now wait a minute, there's a door up here on the left. Wait a minute, let me get it, let me get it. I'm, I, I, the fact that I haven't run to Spongebob yet is honestly unbelievable. But listen, let me count my blessings while I have them. Oh, I forgot there was a turn. Okay, it's right here. There it is. Is he not in here? Double dot, brown, key. Radio. Maybe I shouldn't turn that on. Okay, maybe I should not turn that on and attract Spongebob to my location. Okay, so I got the key. This has been located, but I still need the code and the lever. And the code is relatively easy. Okay, all I gotta do is run around this joint and get all of the shit before I get tossed. But I should be able to put the key in here, right? I need to solve the code. Yeah, okay, so I put it in there. I'm just gonna run around and take pictures of all of the data that I have so far and look for the level while I'm at it. Now, are we gonna get tossed in the meantime? Almost certainly. Am I concerned about that? No! Because I know where the key's at and I'll be able to find the lever short. You can get bamboozled if you got jump scared trying to take that picture. That's probably what's gonna happen to me, let's be honest. He's gonna catch me on one of them doorways I know he is. I'm gonna shit my pants. Got it! I'm not even mad! I'm not even mad! I got the picture! I was Samaruski, you bitch! Got it. Got the pick. I ain't even tripping. I got the pick. I ain't even tripping. This has shiny objects, but you can't interact with it at all. Okay. Yeah, there's no lever or nothing. Not, not that I can see. No items to interact with, nothing. Kick me here. Is that just a meme or can I actually kick that bitch? No, I think it's just a meme, bro. I think it's just a meme. Okay, that bitch not trying to get actually tossed. Which is a free service I provide, by the way. But he, he, he ain't want it, he ain't want it. Okay, Patty, okay. Back it up. Move it, no, fuck! Okay, so that bitch got a hitbox the size of a freight train also. For anybody looking for a little bit of info, Mathion, that bitch can get you about 27 feet away and still get your ass, even if you seem like you out of range. Okay, because I, I still feel like at the distance that I was at, it shouldn't have triggered the jump scare, but it did. So I guess I'll fuck myself. But I need to, what I need to do actually, hold on. Let's see if I have all the data points. How many how many arrows are there? Six. I got them all. I got them all. So y'all remember this. Right? Y'all remember that? 
this is the order that you're supposed to put the shits in, and this one is what each of the numbers equates to. Okay, so let me do this real quick. Let me calculate. Okay, I've got the code, gang. I've got the code. And let me tell you, that bitch is advanced. Okay, the fact that they think you're gonna be sitting there at that doorway where you punch in the code, sitting there like doing the mastery of that equation, leaves me flabbergasted. Okay, you'd have to have goddamn wits of steel to do that shit while SpongeBob was hunting your ass. No thank you, no thank you. I'd rather cheat, bitch. And I will be cheating. I hope that was the same. These don't change, do they? Wait a minute, let me make sure that's the same as my <laughs> Oh no, okay, for some reason I thought that didn't match what my picture was and I was like, no shot, bitch. I was about to say, no shot, bitch. But we all right, we all right, we all right. Okay, so my code will still work. Bazinga, move. There it is. That's all me, thank you, baby. Let's go! Okay. Now we're gonna take it up and around town, dead end, of course. Now my code's gonna be up here on the side. Let me get my let me get my code ready. Okay, got it ready. Here it is. Look, they they they, they okay. Here's here's a refresher for anybody interested. I don't have time for that shit right now. But that's for you if you're interested. Okay, seven. Turn on the power. They 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 gonna eat my ass, bro. They can eat my ass. I have to turn on the power to enter the code, even though I entered the code in the other room and didn't require the power. Where's the lever? Oh my god, okay, so the power is first. I thought you might do the power second. But you don't. I don't know where the lever's at. I haven't seen anything that even remotely resembles a lever. And this is a dead end, just straight up. Wait, so I'm missing something. Fuck! Is it one of these shits on the floor? There's so much bullshit in here, bro. It could be anything. Okay, here we go. All right, here goes the bomb, bitch. Oh, shit! Bomb! Bro, 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 bro. Good night to America! Hello, Toss Nation, that bitch! That's unbelievable gameplay, bro. Unbelievable gameplay! Okay, y'all see where we're at? We're back here in the robo den. Now I know what you're thinking. You're thinking like I was thinking. There's not f all in this room. This room just exists for, you know, for the, for the, for the memes, bro. For the memes. But looky here, y'all. This goddamn worm teeth having ass bitch has my shit. Bro, that's where they put it at. They put it up there, up and out of your reach. So it was not easy to identify. Now that, ladies and gentlemen, is cuckoo crazy. That shit has me fucking tilted, bro. There's something about these damn SpongeBob games that just makes my blood pressure boil, bitch. Fuck. Let me relax. Bro, they always got this shit hidden and hidden nasty as hell. But you know what? We got it. We got it. Let me go run this shit back. Now, we might run into SpongeBob, actually, now that I think about it. Because this is not the ideal pathing situation. But I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. Hopefully, we'll go off. Oh, you can actually see. Oh, wait, you can actually see. Oh, that's huge for the program. Okay, I'm popping then. I right, wait a minute. Let me get my passcode. Wait a minute. Let me not. Okay, I don't even see Cheeks, bro. Oh, my God. Cheeks isn't even here. I'm going off. This is free. This is free. Unless he can... Unless he can see me all the way up the hallway. No, no eyes on cheeks. I repeat, no eyes on cheeks! Look at this long, blank hallway they put in this game, bro. Unbelievable level design. Unbelievable level design. And by that, I mean there's literally none, you motherfuckers! Bro, there's literally none. Okay, here we go. Seven. Nine. Six. Eight. Five. Two. Enter. I was gonna say that has to be right. What is this? There's a hooky. What is that? A clarinet? Okay, anytime I see some bitch sucking on some shit, I know I gotta check it out, bro. Oh, thank goodness, I finally escaped. Who are you anyway? Wait, who am I? Oh. I'm Plankton, and I need your help to get out of this cage. Well, how come Plankton always getting tossed by his own inventions? Little pea brain ass bitch! Seriously? You're so small, you could easily walk well, out of the may cage. Seem that way, but your comment about me being small did stick But what are you talking about? It's literally a fact! Okay, sorry. You are the biggest thing in the ocean. He. Yeah. Uh, the thing is, a creepy sponge underestimated me and thought I couldn't escape from a cage three times my size. Can you believe it? Bro, you're the one who got put in the cage by the sponge. You dumb bitch. Wow. 
That's quite a feat. My apologies for underestimating you. Please, we don't have time to dwell on it. We need to head to my lab and create a weapon to deal with that creepy spawn you mentioned. Okay, so let's get it done. Wait, you created that thing? But let's focus on finding a solution. We'll create a weapon that can effectively combat it. Come on, let's go to my lab. Okay, let's let's do it. Well, let's run this shit back. My man, are you gonna are you gonna do your thing or what? Oh, oh, we teleported! Oh, thank God! Okay, we teleported to the lab. What the hell? Oh, I'm playing Mario Kart! What the fuck? Well, what is this? There's literally two SpongeBob's in front of me and they're throwing back boxes? What is going on? This might be the worst game ever made, Bo. I understand what the... Oh, my God, that bitch almost got my ass. I understand what they're going for, but I did not expect Fast and Furious fucking gameplay with SpongeBob and his clone in two boat mobiles in front of me. How long is this chasing? I'm actually asleep, bitch. Okay, this is great, but I didn't know I was going on a road trip through Wyoming, you motherfucker. Let's get this shit done! Am I supposed to be doing something on God or like? No, absolutely not, I don't think. There's nothing else to do. You can't click her. Oh, oh, I... did I make it and I get tossed? I have no idea. A few moments oh! later. Oh! Are we at the lab? We are at the lab. Okay, this is no doubt the most detailed piece of, uh, you know, uh, gameplay that they've made. What now? To create the weapon, I need something very special. You must get a group of tiny SpongeBob's and a cup of coffee, but they can only be found in the alternate reality. This bitch gonna send me to an alternate reality? Oh, so why does this bitch suddenly sound like a German mad scientist? What the fuck? Oh, uh, wait. Tiny SpongeBob's and a cup of coffee? Th that's unusual. How do the I get that? The ultimate reality, the evil sponge has caused chaos and disruption, but that's where the tiny SpongeBob's and the cup of coffee exist. You must be cautious as you navigate through the topsy-turvy world. What? I can't believe we're doing this, but time is of the essence. What do I've I need to do? I've prepared a special grappling gun. Use it to enter the machine that will transport you to the alternate reality. Once there, find the minuscule SpongeBob's and the elusive cup of coffee. Our world's future hangs in the balance. Bo, this is unbelievable gameplay. This is a strange and risky mission, but I'll do whatever it takes. Grappling gun and enter the machine. Wish me luck. Okay, so where's my gun at? It's got to be this thing. Okay, that's literally a Terminator blaster, bro. This is literally a term. Is this a grappling gun? Are we pretending this is a grappling gun? Because this has me bamboozled beyond belief. Is it this thing? What the fuck? Where's the machine, bro? Where's where's the alternate react? Oh. Understood. Okay, so it's definitely this. I'm pretty sure I just got bamboozled. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get killed. There is no way that this 100% metal box with no other, like, features at all is an alternate reality machine teleporter. Okay, they fucking lie. What's going on, bro? This thing take forever. Uh oh. Okay, probably too late to say this now, but epilepsy warning. Hold the left mouse button to grapple, space to jump. Bro, sorry, what the? Left mouse button to grapple. I'm doing that. Wait, I'm super confused. I'm doing that? Oh, 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 wait a minute. Wait, they don't mean like grapple the SpongeBob. They mean play Spider-Man in that ass. I'm cooked, bro. I'm dead. I fucking met the gods immediately. I got fucking tossed immediately. Hold the left mouse button to grapple, space to jump. Okay, so the space button does work. I'm super confused. I cannot grapple anything, it seems like. Or is it this? Oh, it is that. I'm actually Spider-Man. What the f*** is this shit? Gang. Wait, this is actually not a meme. They're serious with this gameplay. Gang. What the f***? What, what can I grapple? Oh my god, I'm fucking cooked! Bro, this is maybe the worst game I've ever played. Okay, just dead ass, straight up, 100%. This is maybe the worst game I've ever played. 
Okay, so I've got four minutes to swing on exclusively these shits I'm seeing. Okay, so I understand the mission. It doesn't make the mission any less stupid. You understand? Is there, is there even a SpongeBob over here? There's literally not even a SpongeBob over here. Is there? Bosiah. Okay, I'm stuck. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Look at how far over that goes, bro. Oh, those, 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 those little black strings are what you're supposed to be grappling to. Okay, but first of all, I don't see another SpongeBob for 200 miles, so I don't really even know where the fuck I'm supposed to be going. Because you go all the way up there, there's nothing. I'm dead. Oh my god, there's two SpongeBobs down there. I just saw them. Did you see them? I'm going in a circle. Hold on. Wait, hold. Wait, I need, I need to swing that. I need to swing that right. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, bitch! Okay, so I got me a double bob. Why is the music suddenly going like that? Am I in danger all of a sudden? I'm under the impression I may now be in danger? Whereas previously I was not? Oh, please, 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 please. Okay, so you actually have pretty good mid-air control. I will give them credit for that. You do have pretty good mid-air control. Uh, I guess that's got something to do with the, uh... The, the futuristic alternate reality world. Okay, there's definitely one right here. Okay, watch out, watch out, watch out. Bazinga, bitch! I honest to God feel like I'm in danger. Oh my God, I thought I was dead. Just a sec. Right here, right here. Bop! What's happening? Oh, I thought I was falling through. I'm okay. Is that one? Wait a minute, check that goddamn pop can. No, we're all right, we're all right. Oh my god, okay, it's, it's 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 trying to kill me right now? Okay, it's going a little haywire, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, grab that, relax. I need this! Thank you. What am I at? Seven out of nine, huge for the program. Please tell me there's two on this. It's a cup of coffee! Oh, I needed that, I needed that, I needed that. Okay, let me not, let me not meme. I needed that, I needed that. I honestly forgot about that. I thought I was cooked, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I need a good trajectory on this. Oh my god, it was Is there two? Please, I need two. They're only giving me one. What do you mean there's only one? Oh, no, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it! Oh, they counted the coffee! Got it. Okay, really with this? We can really do without this! Bro, my eyes are so, like, sensitive to color right now. I'm pretty sure... Unbelievable gameplay. Next time y'all decide to star in a video game that I might play on my YouTube channel, you need to tell me first! Oh, I'm being chased. I just got turned around. I'm definitely being chased. I mean, look at, look at Bughead, bro. I think I'm in a maze. I'm in some kind of horrific, horrifically goddamn cringe maze, bro. There's a turn here. Bosiah, what the fuck is this? Like, I, I, I'm really only looking at the darkness in front of me. Oh my god! What the fuck is this shit? Oh wait, what the fuck? Gang, he got cooked. That little bitch... Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, what are you kidding me? Bro, that is the most what experience I've ever had. Bro, I am flabbergasted by what we just saw in this gameplay. And like I said at the beginning, y'all, this is most definitely not around the clock at Bikini Bottom 2.
But I hope that y'all enjoyed this gameplay regardless of SpongeBob's evil clone. No doubt one of the most demented SpongeBob horror games we've seen in a long time. If y'all enjoyed this shit, y'all want to see me check out the to be continued, whatever the fuck that means, make sure y'all let me know that down below and suggest some other games to play down below as well. I love and appreciate y'all. I'm going to see you tomorrow. Hey, yo, if y'all like SpongeBob horror games, go watch my original Around the Clock series in case you missed it. Okay, those shits are actually good. <coughs> love and appreciate y'all. Goodbye.